Welcome to Pre-Math. In this video tutorial, we have got these two polygons. One of them is hexagon, the other one is octagon. And now we are going to calculate the angle between these two polygons, the angle X. And moreover, I am going to share with you two different methods as how to find the value of this angle X. So let's go ahead and get started with our solution. And just keep in your mind that we are dealing with the regular polygons. That means all sides are equal. And here's our very first method. So let's talk about this regular octagon. That means eight sided shape. This one, the purple one, since it's an eight sided shape, I'm going to call N equals to eight. And here's our green hexagon, that means six-sided shape. And no wonder I'm going to call n equal to six on this side. And in this first method, we will be talking about exterior angles of these polygons. And if we draw this vertical line, we can see that this side is our exterior angle for this hexagon and this side this angle is exterior angle for octagon and one more thing just keep in your mind that the sum of the exterior angles of any polygon are 360 degrees total angles let's focus on this hexagon so this angle plus this angle plus this angle plus this angle plus this angle and plus this angle all these are our exterior angles and if we add them we are going to have this 360 degree angles and as far as this octagon is concerned if we add all these exterior angles the sum of all these angles are going to be once again 360 degrees always so that means each exterior angle is going to be 360 degrees divided by n where n represents the number of sides so let's focus on this hexagon the green shape each exterior angle is going to be 360 degrees divided by n in our case is 6 so that is going to be 60 degrees so that means this exterior angle is going to be 60 degrees now let's focus on our octagon this purple shape each exterior angle is going to be 360 degrees divided by 8 the number of sides so that is going to give us 45 degrees so that means this side our exterior angle is going to be 45 degrees and now let's go ahead and calculate this whole angle this whole angle is our angle x isn't it and now we can see that this angle x is the sum of these two angles the exterior angle 60 degrees on this side and 45 degrees on this side let's go ahead and add them up so therefore i wrote down x equal to 60 degrees plus 45 let's add them up and that is going to give us 105 degrees and that is our x value and here's our second method and we will be using interior angles this time for these polygons and here's the formula of the sum of the interior angles of these polygons total interior angles equal to 180 degrees times n minus 2 where n is the number of sides now let's focus on our hexagon this green shape so since they are n equal to six sides here i replace this n by six and if we multiply them out we got our total interior angles turn out to be a 720 degrees for this hexagon and now let's focus on this octagon this purple shape and this time our n is 8 i replace this n by 8 over 
here and if we multiply everything out our total interior angles of this octagon turns out to be 1080 degrees so thus the formula for each interior angle is going to be simply 180 degrees time n minus 2 divided by this n so thus our each interior angle for hexagon turns out to be this 720 degrees divided by n equal to 6 and if we divide that that turns out to be 120 degrees and likewise for octagon each interior angle is going to be this total number of these angles are 1080 divided by number of sides is 8 you divide that one out and our each interior angle is going to be 135 degrees so thus our each interior angle for this hexagon turns out to be 120 degrees as you can see over here all these angles and moreover the interior angle each interior angle for this octagon are 135 degree each now let's go ahead and calculate this angle x over here this one we know that these two angles are 120 degrees and 135 degrees and this whole angle is 360 degrees so thus our x value turns out to be 360 degrees minus these two interior angles and it turns out to be 105 degrees thanks for watching and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos bye